Chidi lifting, striking, high ball, up field, dropping it out 30 yards out from the corner. Getting ready. very little chances and as I said, said at half time if Haverty kept taking his points that was it and he came out around 70 yards and he still kept up with over the bear. Pints at the sport more or less would count three pints at the end. I think that was a great display for Clemmer Daly and the supporters would be very proud of them. Uh, one thing I know about Clemmer Daly today is that as I think about they never panicked at any time of the game. No, never. Um, you know, as I said, with the ball is around the square, it was always dangerous. Turlock Moore put forward line was, you know, goals were there. Calamity Daly put forward line wouldn't do that, but as I say, they, they were faster than the ball. I think they were they were definitely hungry for this title, and it showed even in the last 10 minutes. You know, they were backing up each other. Great work there by, as I said, the three Ryans, played magnificent. So did both. Uh, Katie, a great second half. What can you say about them? I thought I said that Calamity Daly were really hungry for victory today. Certainly, Calamity Daly did. As I say, I didn't believe that they could lift the game so much in the second half, but as I said, at half time, the Bushman certainly had a pep talk in the dressing room. Um, and Charlotte Moore would be disappointed, but as again, as I say, I think they deserve this time of day. They have been knocking at the door now for so many years. A very good day for hurling at both times. Certainly, it must be a great day, as I say, East Galway back again at the top. Um, you have a big cup of the next year now, TV the forward. And as I say, he arrived, he must get a run of the season. Well, that's
great day for you. And a great day for Clamour Daily. How do you feel now? I feel absolutely brilliant. You know, every game that we have played this year so far, you know, we have just scraped it, you know, and we're building on that, you know. And uh, we had a good few meetings, you know, and uh, we were just saying, you know, that it was a good fine day for us, and we knew that Bannistown was good and right, you know. We trained very, extremely, very hard for this day today, you know, and we knew that we'd be extremely fit, you know. So, having played so well in the first half, and yes, but having done it at half time, a point out, did that worry you? No, no. Definitely not, because there was a slight bit of a breeze there when we, we had it in the second half, you know, and if we came out and got a good fast score, you know, that's to be not things again, you know, so we're back on the winning table. Well, after all, to be all Ireland, today must be a very sweet hour for you. Oh, beautiful, beautiful. Yeah. Yeah. Well, would you agree if I said that the difference between Clamour Daly today and Clamour Daly at the last two county finals is that they have matured a lot, and they never panicked at any stage, and they kept hurling all... The 60 minutes. Definitely, that is the truth, definitely. That went right through to the 60 minutes. Definitely. They took their chances when they got them, and like, you have to really support them in the face today, so that's the way. Uh, I know there were 15 stars out there, but there were a few that must have caught your eye. In particular, I caught myself looking down from the conscious position, but in your eyes, for his size and his pounds. Way out in front of you there was, was, was exceptionally good. Brilliant. It, you know, when Andy Ryan gets the ball, it gives the fella behind you a great relief for the same ball in the Because he really has the speed and determination on our side. Definitely, he was outstanding for the Andy Ryan. Definitely. Well, they all say this is what Clamour Daily hurling means. I know there's a lot of people in the club that have worked for years and years and years. A lot of people have brought you up to the ranks, like work and other people like that. It's a great day for them and it's a great day for Clamour Daily. And I'm sure, Tony, that you will do the celebration. That is for sure. Right? That is for sure. Would you be ready for another interview in a month's time? No, no, no. no okay, no, thank no, you, Tony. No, Thanks, no. The power when you're, when you're carrying that. Yeah. You had a, a great victory today. We had indeed, yeah. I mean, we've been trying to for a few years, and it came off today. That's that's most of them really. Towards you, let's face it. I don't think many people get good judges. We won it through hard work. Let's face it. We didn't win a soft. It took a lot of hard work to even break, get, make the breakthrough for the first time. So, you know, I think we quite have some other guys ever. Uh, we worried at any time in the game that it, that it may be slipping away again for me. I was a little worried about getting the goal before half time, really. Uh, still a good goal, let's face it. We, we, you know, maybe we should have gotten away, but it's been to maybe a fantastic double kick. So uh, I was a little worried at that stage. Um, I think our management played a great job with the half time, really. Pulled us together, and uh, we went up and down in the and didn't care. One thing I noticed, um, Michael, looking down from the competition, was that some of the younger players really shone today. Yeah, absolutely. Did I take my camera, for instance? I know one, no 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 but the guy is just he's full of goods and um, the right type of attitude. He's just he's a nice guy and he got his reward today. Yeah. Take a nice man, you're right. That guy's magic, to be fair though. You know, he, he's, he's so good, he's so good and so committed. Um, he deserves it. Yeah, well, I think the general consensus is that Hainer and Cardio is man of the match, even though we hastily add that there were 15 stars out there for Calabria Daily today. But then you're